mahalo for tuning into Island Focus and joining me in meeting Jaina Uihara, who is the Business Action Center Manager with DCCA. Appreciate you taking the time to be with us today in this beautiful setting away from Honolulu. <laughs> Thank you for having me. <laughs> but what you do is in Honolulu. Um, right. Tell us a little bit about your job and the center. Well, the Business Action Center is a program of the Department of Commerce and Consumer Affairs for the state of Hawaii. And it, we're actually a part of the Business Registration Division. We have offices on three different islands. So Oahu is our main office, but we also have um, a, an office in Maui and one in Hawaii County, which is a part-time office. And basically what we do is we provide personal assistance for people who want to start businesses in Hawaii. So when we say personal assistance, you know, there's mm -hmm. the logistics of starting a business. There's also you know, emotional support. Um, what facet in particular do you focus on? I think we focus more on education. Um, so when someone walks into our center, um, we're, we're known as kind of like a one-stop shop for the state of Hawaii's business registration and tax licensing. So not only do we help people do the business registration forms, which means if you wanted to start a business entity like an LLC, corporation, or a partnership, we would actually help them walk through the form. And what that does is um, it, it minimizes the chances that that filing is going to be rejected by the, by the reviewing agency. So we want to kind of help facilitate that transaction. Um, the other thing that we do is maybe trade names or trademarks, hmm. um, if you wanted to register something like that. And all of these terms I'm throwing at you, but, um, and a lot of people don't know the differences. So we're there to help educate people on what the differences are um, and how to fill out the forms. I think it could be very overwhelming, you know? I mean, if I wanted to have a lunch wagon, you know, with all of the lunch wagons that are existing, mm -hmm. but, I, but I have food that I want to offer, you know? Um, I would go to see you first, but where would you start, you know? Right, so what we do is we provide the basic registration. So as I mentioned before, um, business registration, but you know, everybody needs a general excise tax license in order to do business in Hawaii. So step by step, you walk right. people through it. Correct. And when they come to visit you, do they have to sign up right away or? No, um, we're a state agency, so we don't charge anything for our services other than the filing fees that um, the accepting agencies will charge for that particular filing. Um, you know, we, we encourage people to come in and just ask questions and see what kind of um, advice and services and help that we can give them. Some people will come in and just say, you know, I just I'm wanted to inquire, what, what does the LLC form look like? Or what does the general excise tax application look like? And we'll show them and, and explain things to them. The great thing about our office is that we also have a lot of tax information. Hmm. We're not with Department of Taxation, but um, we have a lot of their publications as well as IRS publications in our office if people are interested in picking um, those types of publications up for, for you know, their easy reading at right. night. <laughs> but, um, you know, we try to direct them to the right publication as well. And, and you also work in partnership with other organizations um, in the community because small business is the mainstay of society. Right. We, um, we understand that what we do is just the very basic registrations and tax licensing. So what we've tried to do is kind of make our center a hub for other types of services that our customers can access. So one of, the, um, one of our great partners is the Federal Small Business Administration. They send um, a representative to our office almost every Monday. And if you, if you schedule an appointment, you can sit down with an SBA counselor for as much time as you need, and you can ask them about all of their financing programs that the federal government has to offer. Or maybe you're interested in finding out about how to become a federal government contractor because those contracts can be mm. quite lucrative. Um, so there's that. And another partner that we have is the Hawaii State Bar Association. Their business law section has um, gotten together a group of volunteers, about seven of them, and they rotate at our office every Thursday. And you can sit down with a very experienced um, lawyer, yeah. business lawyer, and ask them whatever questions that, that you would like for half an hour. Huh. It's such a great service, and I think we were the first uh, organization to have such a program in the nation. So as we wrap up our, our meet and greet today, um, a, 
a quick thought on one of the great successes that someone came in and wanted help and that you've had since you've been there. You know, I, I have a great staff. Um, they are so professional and knowledgeable, friendly and helpful and very compassionate. And so I will often get um, a lot of feedback from our customers on what a good experience they had. And it might be just something as simple as, you know, um, you really helped me walk me through this process. It was painless. I didn't think it was going to be, you know, take so short and of a no time. And no mystery. <laughs> right. And you demystified things for me. Um, and that's really what we're wanting to do is really educate our customers um, to bring them to a level of proficiency where they can run their business instead of worrying about paperwork. Well, thank you very much for sharing that enthusiasm. We've been chatting with Jaina Uihara, who is the manager at the Business Action Center with DCCA. Aloha.